Hello Leo, this is your daily for the 9th through the 10th. This is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. <clears throat> if you guys are new to the channel, welcome. Please hit the like button, share the video, subscribe to the channel. We're going to go ahead and get started with an angel prayers card for you guys. We have Speak Your Truth, Arch Archangel Gabriel. Thank you, Gabriel, for helping me to speak with integrity. Okay. So that is the theme for today. Let's see what you guys have for today. What's going on with my Leos? Speak the truth. Hmm. Huh. Hmm. Leos, I get the feeling that um, there's somebody that you guys left behind. Um, somebody that <clears throat> you share some heartache with. Um, I feel like this is a shared energy for different reasons on both of your parts, I'm sure. But there is somebody that you once looked at as um, basically your everything, I feel. Somebody that you felt like was very attractive, um, very caring, very motherly. Somebody that, you know, had this artistic expression, um, not necessarily like, you know, graphic design or something, but somebody that was very creative in, in maybe their look maybe how they dress um there was something very <laughs> appealing about this person sorry guys um and you looked at them like somebody who you you know could possibly spend a lot of time with if not the rest of your life with i feel okay for some of you this is actually a mother figure who you are um probably don't get along well with is not currently getting along well with here and you're wanting to move out possibly okay um but for those of you who this is a love connection with or situation with um there's somebody i feel that you want to you want to say something to there's something that's bothering you um Something's bothering you heavily, I feel. And I feel like usually you're very confident. But I think there is a level of insecurity when it comes to approaching this person. So you're not sure right now how to approach this person, I feel. But they are still weighing very heavily on your mind here. Okay? Very heavily. There's something also I feel like you guys want to say that this person has possibly done that you feel like is a slight towards you you want to engage with them maybe you feel like you don't have a right to at this point but there there's something that you want to say here okay let's see what is the cause of this situation currently today hmm I think this is somebody that you actually did move away from. For those of you who this is involving your mother or even your father, okay, and you had an argument with, um, some of you have actually moved away. It was like sudden here. And you actually, have, you know, you've gotten your own place. You're getting your stability back. Um, you're feeling comfortable. You're interacting with people. Maybe you couldn't have company or, or whatever the case may be um, with this situation where you had to move out. Okay. But, excuse me, guys. But for those of you who this is um, a relationship issue for... 
I feel like you guys, the issue probably, what I'm getting strongly, is that you guys at one point had a lot of communication. You talked a lot. Um, and I feel like, you know, it was loving. But at some point, um, I feel like whoever you are thinking about right now, you feel like they were kind of controlling. Um, maybe they were a little too mothering. And you guys ended up leaving. Okay? You ended up having to maybe, you know, move across country or, you know, move across the water. And you had to end up getting another place here. But a lot of you are thinking about the commitment that you guys shared. Some of you want to go back to that commitment. Some of you want to come out of this broken heart situation with this person. Whatever hurt you, whatever broke you up. Um, you just want to move past and I think you actually want to um, maybe, you know, reconnect with this person or them you. Okay, because keep in mind that whatever I say, you know, this could be somebody thinking this about you as well. All right, because I'm just picking up on the energy here. So that is a situation. And the reason why I say you want to come back is because here in the Eight of Wands, you actually, some of you moved away. You had to move away or um, the situation became so what you may feel like was toxic that you were forced to move. There was no other choice. But we go from the Eight of Wands to the Four of Wands, which is basically coming back to the root issue of this connection. Okay, so but some of you are unsure about it. All right, so let's see what the outside influence is for you guys. Hmm. There's somebody that you feel like has completely turned their back, um, they've let go of this, they're moving on. And I, I don't know if the energy, you, you can feel that energy. Um, sometimes you can. You can actually kind of sense when somebody is really moving away from you. Not that, you know, the physical breakup, but um, you can sense that the person is actually like taking their energy. They, they are actually moving on towards something else. And I, I think that's what's going on here. So we have um, a water sign here. Cancer, Virgo, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. We have um, Fire, Aries, Leo, Sag. Um, could very well be another fire sign like yourself. And um, we have Air, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Okay? So let's see what the advice is here, guys. Hmm. I think there you've been holding on so long for to whatever it is that you are feeling. I feel like this is you really letting go, really releasing whatever it is that you are feeling inside, let it go. If you're feeling like, you know, you're not going to take the chance and being rejected or whatever, let it go. If there's something that you want to say and you're feeling, <clears throat> excuse me, too proud to say it, my gosh, let it go. Okay. This is, this is killing those things that are not serving you. This is letting those things go that are not serving you, not in your highest good. So... If there's something that you want to say, go ahead and speak your truth, okay? So that is the advice for you guys. That is your daily <clears throat> for the 9th through the 10th. I don't know what's wrong with me. And um, I'll be speaking with you guys soon. Bye now.